Hey there, Chili Heads and Chili Head friends and all my fans and followers. Tonight we're coming to you with a, uh, a special video. Um, you know, I have uh, several followers, uh, co-workers, and uh, well, I had uh, two co-workers uh, decided they wanted to take a shot at a ghost pepper. And unfortunately, the one uh, kind of pushed out a little bit. For whatever reason, I don't know, but he's not here. So that gives me the opportunity to talk a little bit of trash. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, but yeah. So Matt here, uh, like I said, he's a fellow co worker and he wasn't about to back down, so he's going to take on this ghost pepper by himself. But I, uh, along with him, is I'm going to take on a, a Maruga. Uh, like I told you in, in my last video, I will be chewing it, up, chewing it up and spitting it out because my stomach just, I just, I just can't handle it. So yeah, here are our specimens. That is the ghost pepper that Matt will be eating. And here is the Maruga that I will be eating. These uh, pods come all the way from Tennessee from my good friend Gregory Dooley, Chattanooga Chili Head. Um, please check out his uh, his website, I'll put the link down in the description. I mean, he's he's got everything from seeds to powders to spices, uh, sauces, you name it. Uh, so yeah, got me a new blade for my videos, so you can actually see the oil on the knife. Gonna go ahead and cut both of them open. Let you have a look. Ooh. That's nasty. Look at all the oil. I like this black blade. You can actually see the oil glisten on it. Mm -hmm. So yeah. Here's the inside of that ghost pepper. Nice, uh, nice looking placenta. A few seeds. Sides are uh, glistening pretty good with oil. Now I'll we'll cut open this maruga. And again, very, very, very oily. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Did you hear that? Oh. <laughs> There's the inside. Massive placenta in this one. You can very much so see the the pools of oil inside, very thin skin, quite a few seeds, so yeah. So, Maruga Scorpion, Ghost Pepper. Are you ready? The whole thing? The whole thing. Chew it up to 30 seconds and swallow it. All right, so here we go. Mm -hmm.
<laughs> wow. Yeah. This Maruga, right off the bat, had kind of a little bit of a sweet tone to it. Pretty florally. Heat is uh, attacking the tip of my tongue, moving back like normal. How you doing? <laughs> Fire. <clears throat> yeah. Ooh. Wow. My mouth is uh, starting to salivate like crazy. Sides of the tongue, lips are frying pretty good now. Ooh, doggy. Oh man. That, this baruga is all as hot as the, the last one I did. Only difference between this one and that one is I won't be getting cramps this time. I promise you that. But uh, yeah, we went ahead and I got him all prepped up. Had a nice uh, pep greasy pepperoni pizza. Had him take a big old glug off a Maalox bottle. And uh, just in case he needs it, I think I will. We got uh, half gallon of the vitamin D milk. How you doing? Oh, I'm burning. Uh-uh. I'm burning. Oh. But yeah, the heat is still climbing. Tongue is just frying. Mm-hmm. Sweating pretty good now. Oh. Sinuses are starting to free up. Starting to leak a little bit from the nose. Uh, oh, it hurts here now. Yeah. <clears throat> Ooh. Yeah. <coughs> but yeah, thank you very much, Greg. Greatly appreciated. I'll uh, be getting to that sauce here very soon, hopefully tomorrow. Probably be doing a couple of sauce videos tomorrow. Oh. Oh. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Shaking in the hands. Where's the hose at? I need hose spray now. Not really attacking. Not my ears aren't going off like like they do normally. I'm feeling it <coughs> solely in the mouth, like all around the tongue. The mouth of the throat is a little hot, but it's staying in the mouth. Whew. <laughs> I told you. Peppers are no joke. Okay. Let's see if this helps. Only gonna help for a couple minutes. Yeah. So I just you know take mouthfuls and swallow it. Let it peek back up. Take that blood. Yeah. Don't drink it too fast because it'll make you sick. <clears throat> It's not so much the mouth, it's down here. It's yeah. That's why I quit swallowing pods, because it 
It's hell in your stomach. Yeah. Even me, for not swallowing the pot, I can starting to feel the effects of the oil right here in my stomach. Yeah. Ooh, doggy. Yeah. But yeah, like I said, uh, you know, you can check out uh, Gregory Dooley on his website, uh, ChattanoogaChiliHead.com, and also find him on Facebook, uh, Gregory Dooley, or, uh, yeah, Gregory Dooley, or I can't remember if he's got a web or uh, Facebook for Chattanooga Chilihead, but I believe he does. Uh, I'll put all those links down in the description. I was uh, reading up on uh, both these pods. You know, like uh, the uh, International Pepper Institute, you know, when they were doing the testing on this Maruga, they, uh, they grew 125 plants, all of different varieties, you know, from the Trinidad Scorpion, um, you know, the Seven Pot. Whew. And uh, once they were ripe, they took uh, a few samples off of each plant, each one of the plants, and they dried them out, and they were crushing them up to make into powder. And, uh, you know, the people that were helping out on this study, you know, they were wearing rubber gloves, but they kept having to constantly change their gloves because the capsicum oil was penetrating the rubber gloves. The, uh, the Maruga, <coughs> excuse me, it, uh, averaged about a 1.6 million, but they had individual pods that shot up well above 2 million. The, uh, Ghost pepper, you know, when they were doing the studies on it, the tests, you know, it ranged anywhere from 800,000 to, uh, you know, a million, uh, what the hell was it? I think it was a million forty thousand or something like that. So, yeah, and that was, you know, individual pods. But yeah, so... Once upon a time, that ghost pepper was the hottest pepper chili in the world until the Maruga come along and knocked it off its throne. That was in uh, 2012. But yeah. Me, uh, my heat, you know, the heat off this Maruga, it's peaked. It, my tongue is starting to melt out now. Yeah. A little bit. I'm the same. I mean, yeah, I'm using the milk, but it's let up a bit. I'm still feeling the cramps. Sweating. Just I feel like I'm everywhere just soaked in it. Yeah. Uh, Ooh, buddy. No. It's a little bit on the lips too, but like I said, it's a, that one was for me it was mostly in the mouth. Not so much the throat. Ugh. Yeah. He should have been here. He's missing out on some fun. Yep. We could have pointed and laughed at each other. Right. Oh well. But all right. Well, uh, thank you everybody for watching. Like I said, this is my buddy Matt, fellow co-worker. So easy, caveman can do it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I yeah. know a few of you like that. But uh, yeah. Anyway, uh, please like, subscribe, share, leave a comment. Um, again, thank you very much, Gregory. You know, I can't thank you enough. And uh, we'll see you all next time. Thanks.